<laughs> All right, let's get started. But anyways, guys, welcome to Aragami. It is a stealth game. I just linked it there in chat. But uh, let's go ahead and get started. So uh, I'm interested to see uh, what this game has to offer. So it does have multiplayer. Okay, oh, chapter one. All right, I'm ready to go. Uh, do I have to do anything? Okay. It's really cool. Okay. You were thinking about getting this game whistles? Nice. It looks like a uh, really fun game. I don't remind me of Okami. I don't know if it's probably like, it's like the art style, the cell shaded graphics. Oh, her name's cut off, but it's, her name is Yamiko. <laughs> I wonder if it's actually Japanese. It almost sounds like you can hear it. Oh, thanks for that host cog, man. I appreciate it. Uh, I tried Shadow Warrior 2. I, I did play it over at TwitchCon, but uh, yeah, no, this game is not free, though. Um, it said that in the like main menu that it was a build version, so I'm not sure if this game is technically still in alpha or if it's like a, pretty much like a, a finished product. It seems like it's pretty complete, though. Uh, any other shadow? And then right, plus the right button to teleport. Okay, then. Burns on your cape, show your current essence level if you're low in essence. Okay, so it looks like there's like a blink. So I can blink through. Oh, okay, so I hold it. Ah, okay, gotcha. So, okay, I want to see if I can cancel my attack into it. Okay. So basically you want to stay in the dark and there's crouch. There you oh, you can even blink upwards. Okay. Now my main question is, can you path through, like, can you clip through areas? Cause it seems like it's a blink and you can obviously go through like, uh, the gated walls, but I wonder if you actually have to have vision of the area that's like physically past there because if you look at on some games, what you can do is you can look like through a building on the side and then you can clip through it. <laughs> it might be a really broken game mechanic if we decide to do speed runs for this game, but yeah. Oh, by two feathers. They even got, they got that musical group. Is it on PS4? Oh yeah, I'm playing this on PC by the way. Oh, he's got that katana. Actually, that's not a katana. <laughs> it? It's probably way too short, yeah. Oh. Oh, I bust out mine. Yo, I do them, them flips too, man. All right, we good. Okay, so yeah, okay. I want to see it like drain. Oh, you can actually see it dr being drained on the cape. That's really cool. I like it when games do that, where you can see like your, like your HP in a sense, where it doesn't like clog up the, uh, the menu. 
Like, it, well, there's no menu really for this, or I guess a uh, HUD is what I meant to say. Like, there's no HUD in this game, which, it, it's nice. Army of Light, okay. What are we playing? It's called Origami. It's a uh, stealth-based game, but you guys know, uh, I'm not really a stealth player, but uh, we'll, we'll see if we can do it. Um, I'm going to actually go to options. I'm going to actually turn the audio up because it seems like it's a little low. But if it's too loud, you guys let me know because oh, it was my first time playing this game. Probably shouldn't have ran towards him, but I wanted to see like the uh, amount of time it takes for the actual person to turn around. I guess you can't hug a, a wall and like uh, shimmy on it. Maybe you have to unlock that, or maybe this you just can't do it right there. I like how it actually kills them instead of like knocking them out. I don't know why that frustrates me in games. So you get double the points for a stealth kill. Ah, oh, corpse. Oh, we, they find corpses. I like how you know if you're in the light or not, because your cape turns red. So, I wonder if you have to actually hide the corpse. Is there a... No? Okay. Am I supposed to teleport in here? So this is what I was talking about uh, on some games. Okay, yeah, you definitely need like an actual path towards it. Or like a uh, visually, like something to make it so you can see through. You saw this on Steam and people said it was good? Oh, that's good news. <laughs> Alright. What if I can teleport up here? Yeah, you can, okay. Oh, aerial kill. Nice. I'll play the game semi self because you don't have like combo systems. Uh, maybe not yet. Maybe I have to get this later. We're gonna get like any other equipment or things to mess around with later on. I'm sure we will. But this game's on Unity, so I'm wondering if someone will eventually make a mod for it to be in first person. Because I like first person stealth games, and there's not that many of them that aren't like horror. I guess there's there's a decent amount of horror ones, and it's not really stealth. It's more so like you avoiding most of the game without like really killing anyone. I'm gonna see what their path is. Or we could just go in. Oh, that also works. Let's see if we can get uh, stealth kill. Oh! Oh, you, you get hit once and you're dead. Okay! Oh, that's a uh, redo arena. Okay. Dang, you can't get spotted once. I can get the thing to line up, okay. Wasn't there a guy right here last time? Oh, okay. Got away from the path, his way down over here. Alright. Press F for the respects. Just bow? Uh, I don't think we have the bow yet. I don't know if there is a bow. Oh, okay, I see how it goes. Okay, so you can engage people, but the thing is, is if someone sees you and you're mid-killing someone, 
it automatically uh, game overs you, basically. Okay. I like the audio in this game, it's really well done. I want to see how close I can get before they actually see me. Gotcha. So I like, I kind of like that mechanic. It, as long as it's a 1v1, you can pretty much get away with things. But uh, if there's multiple people, you have to uh, just disengage or just not engage it at all. Why did I choose this game? It looks like a good game to me. Like, I don't know. I haven't played uh, a stealth game in quite some time. Uh, do I have to teleport from stealth to... I want to teleport over there. Oh. Oh, that's... That's really cool. Okay. This game is amazing because there's no cooldown on this, right? The last guy. Okay, I just have to make sure there's not two people. That That is well done. Oh! Damn, we got the alert triggered though. I wonder where they will be coming from. Probably shouldn't be in the uh, light over here. Let's go back into the dark. I'm, I'm guessing we progress by going this way, but if I can get more like points, I don't know what points do in this game. I don't know if it's for upgrades or if it's just like for speed run, I guess like points. I don't see anyone. Oh, you know what it does? It puts, I guess, my guess is that you can't progress because there was like a, a fog of war wall. So yeah, that might be that. Oh, okay. We got to see. <laughs> uh, okay. No. Oh, you can get, oh, you can win without killing the enemies. I had no idea. Okay. Well, now I know that you can beat the game without killing enemies. Well, I assume you can. Uh, maybe there's a boss you have to kill or something like that. Hidden scrolls unlock new skills and learn more about the world. Oh, so there's new skills in the game. All right. So I'm guessing uh, it's like a crafting table. Oh no. Okay. I didn't know. I I don't know. Do you guys want me to try not to kill anything? I assume most of you guys are like, no, nah, no, nah, kill everything. <laughs> Which uh, I don't mind doing. I think that's how I want to play the game because that movement system is really good. No cooldown on your teleports. That's awesome stuff. Wait, how, how is it Dan's game if we have no cooldown? I think that's awesome. It's PvE anyways. There's no PvP. Well, there's multiplayer. But I think it's co-op multiplayer. Evaporating. Oh. oh, a new skill probably. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, skill points. Oh, yeah. Okay, locate scrolls uh, about the past to unlock his potential. Open the skill screen by pressing F1. Okay. Okay. Oh, so certain things cost more than one. Shadow creation, aim at any unlit surface to cast shadows. Oh, okay. Um, is there, oh, kunai? Uh, with the, make your kunai completely silent. No one would hear a victim scream. Wow, that's pretty good. Throw a wave of shadows to blind. Uh, considering this costs three, it kills them. I think that's kind of better. Uh, Kusuna can be used to blind distance targets. Oh, this is a close up. And it's in front of you. Puts a trap. Okay. Uh, place your sh shinin on the back of a living target. No one will see this coming. Huh. Uh, 
So I don't know if this costs mana or if it's like you have to like use some type of like, uh, I don't know, uh, not currency, but like some type of like uh, cooldown or I don't know anything about it. I wish they, they were more descriptive about this. Um, decoy. Did decoy explodes? Oh, it blinds. I'd rather just go for kills. Uh, ooh, that's pretty good. Revealing enemies through walls. Um, keeps tart. Ooh, that's kind of nice to have all the scrolls for like. So like, that's probably like a decent thing to invest to early on. Uh, approach a dead guard and make his body disappear. Ooh, that's kind of good too. Uh, summon a monstrous beast from the shadows to erase a target from the physical realm and recover one of your equipped shadow technique. Uh, okay, so maybe that that's the type of currency. Uh, oh, Oh, okay, so I'm guessing that Shadow Essence is like our mana, I want to say. I think I want to go with the Kunai. What's up, Ace? It's going pretty good. Oh, wait, there says F3 Tutorial. Okay. Is there like a... That's it for the tutorial? Oh. So... It just removes them from the game, or is it... Just... That seems like it's the best, but I guess it's a trap. I'd rather just... I'd rather go with Kunai. We're gonna go with Kunai. All right. Enough looking at the thing. You want Dishonored too? Uh, yeah. Actually, I think we came from that way. Wait, can I do this while standing? Okay, I can. Okay, so I don't even need to crouch. Oh, why is it telling me about this? Okay, F1. Okay, I did it. I think I have to buy that first one. Unless there's a... Yeah, I think I have to create the shadow. Wait, it just, it just, I just get to put it anywhere? Right. Okay. Okay, that skill is... Uh, okay, so it's trying to show me the mechanic. How much does this cost? Uh, I get I get I get it, I get it, okay. I'd rather just go with Kunai, but we have to get this one. It's required. You can put it on ledges? That's ridiculously good. I'll have to wait for my thing to charge up again, though. But it's balanced in a sense, because it doesn't just stay there forever. If, like, the shadows stay there forever, you can just put it anywhere. Do I have a good PC? Uh, I have 16 gigs of RAM, GTX 980, and the i7-2600. My processor's really outdated, but... It, it was really good at the time, so I haven't needed to upgrade it in a while. But I think for some games, I probably will eventually need to do that. is so overpowered but I'll probably learn that it's not like super super OP the problem is, is the bodies that I'm gonna have to deal with no as long as that guy doesn't see me we're good I got stealth. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, there we go. No! <laughs> 
rip me. Uh, oh! <laughs> okay, so I guess they can hit you with range without even, uh... <laughs> without you uh, doing the animation to uh, kill. I wonder if I actually need to crouch in this game. I want to do it like as action oriented as possible. And yeah, the problem is the bodies. I definitely need to be able to clear the, the bodies. So I might actually get that perk first. Because the kunai costs a lot. Oh, no. Oh, if he calls an alarm. Oh! Hey, minus 500. <laughs> Rip so many points. Oh! Okay. You really gotta play it self. <laughs> I think unless we get the... Uh... Oh, that's a really bad opener. Uh, but until we get some of the stuff, I think we have to play it like this. Oh, he had priority on me. <laughs> Any games I'm looking forward to? Uh, Guardians of Ember, Diablo 4, or and or expansion pack. That's a really bad start. I, don't, I like this game a lot. This is really cool right now. But obviously this is like a single player game. Uh, I know it has co-op, but it's... I mean, unless we do some speed runs. Oh, no, that's probably... So, oh. Can we just run? I'm actually kind of curious. Oh. Guess you can't dodge that. I'm gonna try to do it without killing anything. Let's, tr let's try that. Oh, you can't jump in this game, that's right. Kill this guy. Hopefully this guy doesn't path to the right. Alright, cause then I can just kill. Oh no no, I'm gonna get killed. No! Oh, it's so close! I was trying to teleport behind him, kill him! Oh, that would've been good. Speedruns for this game could be really good. I just have to learn the uh, the correct path things for everything. Oh, get over there. Damn. I guess I didn't have enough mana. But I, I, I want to get this down. I know I keep on like goofing it, but I want to try to be able to do it faster because if I'm going to this game like again i want to get like start learning the speed run because it seems like it's a pretty decent game for the speed runs and they could probably look really ridiculously swag like you could totally style on your opponents in this game damn I wonder if you can go in the water on this game. Let's find out. Oh! Okay, I didn't I didn't know if you died in the water. <laughs> oh, we had such a good run, too. Oh, what the heck? You destroyed me, like, instantly right there.
Okay. I feel so dumb because I just did that. I want to go to options. I want to keybind something. Uh, channel would be under controls. Where is keybinds? There's no keybinds? I'm blind? Toggle crouch. Oh, I do want this actually on. I guess there's no keybind. Okay. Oh, this is all like uh, shade. Wait for him to turn around. All right, there we go. What's up, Super Mayo? Where's the viewers? I don't know. Aren't you here, Super Sheep? Uh, I'm wondering if I like, don't want that. I, I can't really engage this fight. Because if I kill one, the other one's gonna see me and he's gonna hit me once. I guess I could just sneak past him? There we go. It, oh, it said redefine control? Am I that blind? Oh, redefine F3. Okay, I was looking over here. All right. You, you are 100% right on that. Okay, I want Crouch to be... Uh, The shadows are really well done in this game. Okay, now we gotta go back. Oh, flip. Well, okay. If this guy goes, uh, come on, can you path? I want to go for the kill because like that's bonus XP. I know you get a bunch of XP if you don't kill anything, but the thing is, we've already killed stuff. I like how that guy literally does not move. But I feel like if I kill the other guy, he's gonna know. So we'll go ahead and uh, get outie. So I think that's the goal right now, anyways. Oh, and everything is still there. Okay. Does this have mission objectives? Okay. Let's go around the other side this time. Oh, okay, maybe that's a better idea. I think we're supposed to go back. Oh, I don't know where's her. We're supposed to go. <laughs> Is there like a uh... back to his path. Replay uh, the Guardians of the Galaxy. I want to goon him once he gets uh, close. It's 
See, that's just so satisfying. I love that in this game. Now I'm wondering, can I path and go? Oh, I can. Ooh, nice. I mean, I guess if I kill all of them, I don't really need to worry about what the objective is because we get all that bonus XP and on top of that, um, there's no one to call the alarm. Oh. Oh, there's a score over here. Ooh, nice. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Is that a stealth kill still? Oh, no, no. No! Oh, rip us. <laughs> Do I watch films often? Maybe I wasn't even supposed to go over here. I'll, I really do want to kill this, though. I don't think I can, though. Yeah. That's... I'm wondering how I'm supposed to actually do this part. Oh, follow the raven was the objective. Okay. That's what I get for not paying attention. That's what I get for, for actually reading chat. Ah, okay, here we go. There is that scroll, though, boys. Do we get the scroll? I don't know, that's an upgrade point. We gotta get the upgrade point. It's worth. Uh, I'm not gonna go for all the kills, though. We won't be, we won't be stupid. Where's the upgrade scroll? Was it like... I think it was... Okay. If I kill this guy, I can make it. Oh, no, there's another guy watching. I have to wait for him to turn around. Or if this guy paths over here. Oh, we already have the scroll. That's that's nice. Okay, let's go. Let's go back. Alright. Oh no no no. Of this game uh, currently it's twenty dollars on Steam. Okay, I didn't know that those things broke, but I good to know. I, I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. Okay, there it is. <laughs> I know I have to go in the shadows, but like, I guess the uh, the area was really small. Oh, you know I have to, gotta recharge. How much does this cost? I want to upgrade the cape size. Uh, we do have another scroll though, right? Or do we just permanently lose that scroll, I guess? Oh no, we have we have one. Okay, it just costs two. Uh, okay, yeah, we, we definitely want to get the kunai. Um, unless there's an upgraded cape. Enhanced recovery by 25%. Uh, no, 25% is not big enough, and there's only one upgrade for that. I would rather just get the kunai. Um, making the scream, I I'm fine with that. That just means more guards will come increase my KD, you know? Chat's quiet. Well, we ought to be quiet. It's a stealth game. If I oh, you know what? <laughs> I don't have enough uh, energy.
Yeah, we're gonna get six talismans. It's like the, uh, was that the, in Zelda, the, uh, what were they called? No, spirit stones or what? I don't remember what they're called. Maybe there's like six worlds. I like this game a lot though. It's it's really good. Oh, by the way, if I'm going too fast, feel free to like pause the uh, the, the vid, and you guys can like read the actual storyline. The storyline doesn't seem too bad. Oh, show up, Zach. Oh, that's so okay. You know, uh, I was gonna say you know what? we should try to kill zero people, but I don't know. It's just more satisfying to get the kill. <laughs> And I think we already killed people. I don't think this like is a different section because we didn't get a grade on it. I like this though. The game offers you the ability to see your entire like area without saying, "Hey, you know what? Throw a raven up in the air and you can scout everything." Like in, in Metal Gear, you can uh, uh, have the binoculars and then you scout everything and then you plan your move. This lets you just see it and like just go for it. And I like that much more. But I have to wait for that guy to turn around or this guy to turn around. So if I kill this guy, this guy's just gonna kill me. Or maybe. I really feel like I need to kill this guy first, though. Right. Uh, he's out of the line of sight. I don't know, I, c I couldn't teleport right to that little, like, thing I made, which is what I wanted to do. Stuck on the corner. So yeah, it doesn't have a cooldown, but it does use up energy. Uh, pretty much, or mana, whatever you want to call it here. Oh, really? What? Felt like he shouldn't have saw me, but oh well. well I blinked kind of in front of him, but... I figured I was fast enough. Because if you're fast enough, it'll still count as a stealth kill. Oh, no mana. <laughs> I want like an extended like uh, mana bar or a cape. Extended cape. Extended mag. Oh, wait, wait. Uh, can I? I don't know. Okay. As long as that guy's turned around. Hello! Oh! My name is Jamal. Every 60 seconds in Africa, a minute, <laughs> minute passes. Together we can stop this. Please spread the word. Oh, we gotta go up here. Thank you for your attention. Yo, Whistles, thanks for the submarine. I appreciate it. Oh, dang. That just came out, it just came out of nowhere. I was like, really into the end. Of the Big Ben Tyrone pops up. Has he made any other videos recently? Uh, wait. Uh, let's just go over here. I thought I was supposed to go down there. That probably would have gotten me killed. Can I move the corpses? Uh, you get a perk to uh, erase them, but there's nothing to move the corpses. See, I'll show you. That, uh, there's a uh, perk. It's uh, approach a dead guard and make the body disappear. So it costs two points into it. I don't think I'm going to go for that. I think what I would rather have... Um, uh, is I would rather have the kunai, uh, which is the, the the next thing that we're gonna get. It costs three upgrade points, and we only have one right now, so yeah. But there is a thing that I was thinking about getting. Um, oh, there's another scroll right here. So th this is what we use to uh, upgrade. There is a thing I'm thinking about. Um, 
Okay, so marking the target, I don't care about. This costs three. I'm sh I mean, I'm pretty sure we need the previous one, like it's a, a skill tree. But if it's not, I'm gonna I'm gonna say one point, and I want to get this because it shows all hidden scrolls around you. So at that point, uh, it could let us get all the other stuff much easier, because this is gonna cost a total of eight. Um, I'm assuming it, you need the kunai one to get to two, but I don't know about this one. We'll see. I I'll I'll save one one point. Uh, or I'll save up and get the next point. We've got a B, not bad. You cannot create shadows on bright, lit, brightly lit surface. Okay, I figured that out the hard way, but yeah, we got it. Yes, man, it says a maze to hosty, what? Okay, it's like too long to read, and I kind of, I kind of want to play this game. Maybe I'll read it during a cutscene. <laughs> I don't know. I'm kind of interested in this game's cutscenes. <laughs> oh, chapter three. So I wonder if there's six chapters, or we have to. Actually, no. It, it probably isn't chapters that that would go up to six. It's like we need six of those like things that I was talking about earlier. I wonder if that little thing is going to give Blair in position. Oh, dang, he might see that body down there. I don't know. Let's actually see that. I, I want to see if he can, like, see bodies from, uh, like, a different, uh, axis in the game. Uh, whatever, we can just kill him then. Nice. Nice! Does the teleport mechanic break the game in your opinion? Is it worth buying? Uh, the teleport doesn't break the game. Ooh. Um, I already tried breaking the game. Uh, or exploiting the game by, by angling my camera. It, you can't, uh, clip through an object from the camera and then teleport towards it, if that's what you're wondering. But if you're asking if the game is good, I think the game is good. Now, as far as buying the game, I don't know how long it is. Oh, oh yeah, so they, they can see. Oh! Nope! Oh! Oh! Oh, we good? We good? Oh, we dodged it. Get behind him! Oh, there we go. Oh, what? What? How did we die? I don't know how we died! Uh, oh well, we're not that far far away, but um, I mean, I like the game. I think it's worth buying in the sense where, like, is the game good for gameplay? Yes. But as far as length, uh, I know some people are like, game is only 10 hours long, not worth it. But for me, I feel like a game is determined its, or determines its, like, value by how fun it is. Like, I paid $60 for God of War Ascension, and the game's like three and a half hours, but I'm okay with that because I like the game and I've played it three times already, but I would rather, I would go for like quality over quantity as far as like length. But that's just how I judge my games. Everyone judges their games differently. Now my other question in this game is, Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, there it goes. Uh -huh, I wanted to teleport and kill that guy, but it's a little too late. I want to know if they can actually see things uh, from below to above. I mean, they give you a decent amount of checkpoints, so if you get caught, it's not that difficult. Some stealth games are very difficult. This one's pretty lenient. Um, it does reset you if you get killed, but it's not like it's super difficult in the sense where it puts you super far back like Ninja Gaiden. Oh, oh my gosh, go back. I wonder if this will work. Nope, it's probably not going to work. Yeah. <laughs> so like, you don't want to engage two enemies at the same time in this game. Or if they're next to each other. But it really makes really good use of shadows in this game, especially since you can create them yourself. I like that. 
I, I want to say this game is unique enough to the point where like I would offer it some some credibility to its uh, uh, game design because so many games these things are just too similar I gotta wait for this guy to path and I want to I want to kill this guy see like things like that it just, it's good it's like well made you know all right, let me see. And I love how you can hit the key and you can know exactly where you're going. Because that's another problem I have in some games, is I don't know where to go. <laughs> Shadow techniques have limited usages. Oh, these dots in your keeper represent the remaining use of the equipped. Approaching a shrine with food. Oh, okay. But we don't even have any uh, technique anyways, but I guess we can hit it anyways. Okay, so going back to this, um, Ghosts over there. Uh, I don't know if this counts as uh, using a, an ability. Does it does it say what it costs? Summon a decoy. I don't know if this costs because I would prefer having the more passive stuff. Um, yeah, that, that's that's a huge deal. Um, you can't you can't save either in this game, so I can't make different save states to like uh, load. We're gonna teleport right there and get that guy. Oh, what? There's another guy over there. I didn't even see that guy. Oh, it's that guy up there. Oh, that was supposed to be a kill. I like how they don't even notice the bodies there. Oh, the, now he found the corpse. <laughs> okay. Uh... Okay, you can't jump in the water either. Might die though. Oh yeah, it, the animation is relatively slow. Um, there is an option that I actually want to uncheck. It's under is it under general. Uh, okay, so when I'm, I'm spotted, I don't want that um, thing to go off. I think I want to try to prioritize the enemies that are above things. Oh, I'm not even in the shadow, so I can't regen. <laughs> Oh, no, no, no. Ooh, that was close. Oh, I need to, I need to teleport. And there's a guy right there. Oh, I need to get behind this. Oh, no. not very good. Uh, let's see if we can do something. Am I not in shadow? Okay. Oh! <laughs> uh, you don't have to kill everyone. You actually can beat this game without killing anyone. Um, I'll try to path towards it without killing anyone this time.
Oh, uh, that's probably a uh, game over. Oh, I'm not even in shadows. Uh, I needed to get that guy killed, though. I should have tried to create a shadow. Don't want the guards to see the bodies. I think a good perk for me to probably get would be the one where their bodies disappear, since I want to play the game this way. Oh, that guy definitely needs to die. But I need to have him turn around first. Right, I'm just gonna keep looking over there. <laughs> the thing with some stealth games is it requires a little bit of patience. Okay, this guy really, really likes this view, so I think we're gonna have to go this way. Did not want to move from that point. Actually, we can get a little bit closer to this guy. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no. That was really important to get that kill. <laughs> like, there's gonna be a lot of kills that are really important for you to get. That was one of them. So let me hit this. Okay. Oh. Hopefully we we hit a checkpoint. So I had to find like six of these Tailsmans. And that's our second one right there. It's like some cherries. Bells. It looks like cherries. Oh, please spam the Kappas. Oh, I, I would I would join you in that spam with the Kappas, but... <laughs> oh, he's coming! Dad's home! <laughs> but this game is not... Uh, this game doesn't let you window full screen, if that makes sense. Or borderless is what some games call it. 
Use the bells, make noise, V. Oh, new ability, pretty cool. Does he, does he actually pull the bell out? Oh, he's kind of glitching in there. Oh, he does actually pull him out. That's cool. Oh, it's actually on his wrist. <laughs> All right. It's the next area. It's a pretty cool ability. Is there an exit right there? Oh, hi. Oh, this is really dangerous. Oh, there's not. It's just that flag I thought it was a... A path to area. Oh! I knew where all these scrolls were, but do we have we have, we have how many points we have? We have two. Okay. So we still need to get one more scroll. But I don't know where any of these scrolls are. I, I assume they're in areas where they're kind of difficult, or they actually might be secrets. We found like two of them, and they don't give them to you like uh, for, for free, basically, except for your first one. But it requires you to spend the point anyways. Oh, it's that way. You're gonna bet Torok? Alright, have a good one, man. This game actually looks dope. Yeah, it's pretty legit. Like, I could recommend this game. It's not a game for everyone, though. Like, any of my followers that like Call of Duty, it's probably not a game that's similar. <laughs> The only thing I don't really like in this game is the backtracking. I mean, I guess it could offer a different path, so to speak, but I don't know. I'm not a fan of backtracking because if you're backtracking and you're playing it stealth, that means you have to do it double. But if you're playing it action based, you only have to play the game once. Or, or the, the level once, essentially, because you don't have to go back. If that makes sense. Oh, teleport behind this guy and kill him. Oh. How many collectibles? There's six scrolls? Oh, that's dirty. I don't know if it's, it said secrets, I don't know, or items, or I don't know if that counts, like, just scrolls. If that dead guard finds, oh. What's up, Simply? Oh, we got snipers now! I just hope the kunai doesn't use energy. <laughs> But I'm probably going to get the scroll upgrade first, because if each area has six scrolls, then uh, investing three points is definitely pretty good. I should start looking for those secret scrolls, because all I need is one, and then we're good. So I'm really bad at spot. Like, a really bad spot. I'm, like, stuck. <laughs> yeah, okay. This is where I'm probably supposed to go. And then I need to go on this side. Uh, I'm 
trying to, to see how I can get these. Uh, maybe I can kill this one? Nope. I'm gonna have to kill this one first. What? Oh, that guy in the top something. Got it. I want to kill the guy at the top and get that extra 100 XP. Right, where's the next area? It just says reach the next area, okay. Disable the light barrier, okay. Best kill. I don't have to kill that guy when he paths over there. This guy, this guy can do the same thing. No, no this guy's like, nah. This is really dangerous. Will we good? Oh, corpse found. Rip. I found a light barrier. That's good. Oh, I found a scroll too. That's really good. Oh, dodged it! Oh, see, that's why I, I like this game. Like, this is super action based, but you can't make a mistake. You make a mistake and you get punished for it because you die. Oh, like, uh. Right now, uh, I don't really know where is a good position. Because I want to kill those, but I don't think I can go upstairs. Because uh, one of the light bears is at the very top. I do want to kill that other guy though. And as soon as you kill someone, when there's these guys that are shooting arrows, I think the greatest thing to do is to instantly teleport somewhere. Uh, this is where the kunai would be very, very helpful. Actually, you know what I do have? I, I have that. Dang, so it's gonna cost us five. Uh huh. Okay, well, you know what? It's one extra point. Okay, so we'll put one point in that, because if we can get all the scrolls, then that's, that's pretty helpful. So, oh, th that's actually kind of helpful. It's really helpful. Oh, no, no, oh, 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 oh. we didn't die. Because water, water kills you instantly in this game. I, I want to teleport on top of that. Got really lucky that it didn't instant kill me. Can't, can't go in the water. We good. We good. I think. I think we're good now. But I need to regen my. Uh, oh, there's another guy. All right, it's fine though. This guy should be real easy to kill. All right. Cut his ass. Oh, Tenchu. I actually believe. I s think I want to say this game was inspired by Tenchu. Uh, I think that was for the. What is it? PlayStation One, right? So old school. I don't know if I should kill that thing first or hit this. Oh, hopefully that didn't get me spotted. Okay, find the talesman. Okay. 
I'm trying to see the path over there. I don't want to get hit by this guy. So I'm, I'm going to make sure I kill him first. There we go. Is there a... I don't think we can go over there. Is there water below me or no? Okay. Maybe I was in the right direction when I killed that other guy to the side. I just have to. Ooh, no, no, no. Oh, okay. I might want to kill this. Ooh, get sniped. Alright, I'm gonna wait till they path. Because I don't want to redo this. Uh, or. Uh, I don't know. I'm feeling like it's pretty safe once I get up there, though. I'm gonna get my energy back up first. Okay. What the heck? Okay, it's that way. It's that uh, triangle looking thing. Oh, wait. I'm... No, actually, I think I can, I can do it. But I can't... Oh, you know what I, I might need to do? No, I can't create a path. It's too far. You know what? Oh, wow. I feel kind of dumb. Okay, I think I know what I need to do, actually. I think all I need to do is do this. Yeah, okay, that's all I needed to do. <laughs> I was thinking that there's another path up there. I bet you there's a scroll somewhere around in the, on the inside of that, but I'm not going to worry too much about the scroll. Let me see if there's anything up. Okay. I'm going to say if there's an alternate path, there might be a secret. Because I do really want one more scroll. Because that's all we need. It's a voodoo doll up in here. You know, it's a con construct. They had texture on the DS. Some of the first DS games were really, really poorly looking. Okay, I thought that there was like a, like a step right there that I could go on and be like, there's a, there's a next scroll. I'm trying to make sure there wasn't an area I missed. I really wish once in a while they just gave us one scroll. <laughs> just one upgrade, because that's all I need. This feels like Legend of Zelda. No, not at all. This is, this is not like a Legend of Zelda clone. Is that last scroll that I need for the next upgrade? I don't think it to be right here, but I am gonna look for it. Oh, that was really 
close. Yeah, we can't make his body go away. <laughs> we don't have that perk yet. Uh, but I really want to find that scroll. So I'm going to kind of look for it a little bit. If you guys see it, you let me know. What the heck is he shooting at me? Maybe it's too high. Please don't see the dead body. <laughs> it doesn't see it. We're good. We're good. I think it's maybe if they, as long as they don't like see you. Oh no! That's really bad. Uh, come on, teleport. Oh! I teleported into- I tried to teleport behind him. <laughs> See, that's what I like about it. Oh, that's bad. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Or mana. Guess it didn't matter. Take the shot. Look at look at look. wow what a camper dude. What a camper. Okay, did you stop aiming? Okay. Perfect timing. <laughs> okay, we're good. I think last time we got screwed over by this guy. Okay. There we go. That's what I wanted to do, but I failed last time. No scrolls? Okay. Oh, yes! Yes! This is all I needed. Okay. Okay, now I can get that one upgrade that lets me see all the scrolls. Yes. Okay. There we go. Now, you can see all the scrolls on the map, which is something we really, really would like to have. So I guess I'm supposed to go that way anyways, so it works out. Just gotta watch my- Ooh, that's a really bad path. Taking it anyways. Oh no, this is so bad. I can't. Oh, I got so lucky. Oh. Oh, is that, there's a there's a scroll. Okay. Oh. Alert triggered. Wait, how much is that thing where it removes the bodies? Well, this one says, oh no, that's a plus. Okay, has anyone in my stream played this game? Uh, because what I want to know is, does Kunai cost that energy thing? I don't know like what exactly costs energy in this game. Um, Yeah, I, yeah, I have no idea. There's nothing. I'm trying to look for like any symbol or anything like that. Oh, thanks, Pegasus. Okay, last time that that was our path towards that last time. I want to take this other route. It seems much safer. 
And you know what? If we had that 25% regen, I bet we could infinitely tell you. Oh, another... We get minus 500s for days, man. Oh, wait. What? It's over there. Oh. Oh wait, both of them all got alerted. I just wanted one. It's fine though. Did we get both? Let's find out. Oh, there we go though. Oh, one of the, the achievement is called Wombo Combo. Wow, that's pretty good. Oh, okay. I want to get behind it though. Oh, but there's a light. Oh, no. Oh, we are so screwed. We Audi. Alright. Okay. Alright, we can kill this guy for sure though. Get him! I'm gonna goon him! No! Uh, I don't know if you guys can see the Steam achievements that pop up, but one of them was actually called Wombo Combo. path. It doesn't matter. Oh, this one looks kind of difficult right here. If I kill this guy, I wonder if they'll see me. There we go. Ooh, secret. Is there a secret scroll down here? This would be like an excellent spot for a secret. But there's there was a, uh, a scroll that was really really close by. Where was it? Oh, it's, it's on this other side of the wall. Oh. What I wish you could clip when you go on the Y axis of this game. Like, like I want to be able to go over there, you know, on top of that. But you can't do it from underneath. It has to be like on the tip. It's really hard to hit. I need more energy. Maybe you're not supposed to. Maybe you're supposed to actually do this. Well, we'll go ahead and do this because it's on the other side anyways. Really? There's nothing down here? Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I think that's really lame. There's like this whole area down here and there's nothing. guys to split up there's three. Oh, okay. maybe this is an area you're supposed to go to if you get caught and you're supposed to hide but I need them to split okay
I want to kill this guy. Disable the light barrier. Okay. Makes sense. Inside this building? Or maybe like on the top level of it. Oh, okay. I get it, I get it. Oh, is this the area that we were in in the bottom? Oh, I didn't see that at all. Okay. Now I see it. You wish there were different kill animations? Lower the bridge. Okay. Well, that's for the, uh... Can I? Can't. Gotta go all the way. See, I don't really like this mechanic. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, hold on, hold on. Maybe I'm bad. No, can't, uh... I wanted to use my uh, ability to teleport, but I don't think you can. So we gotta go over there again. And we already killed the uh, archer there, so we're good. I wanna say we could just run up there, but like, I don't wanna get spotted by an archer, <laughs> get wrecked. All right. Oh, you know what? I'm out of energy. Oh, I, I would test if I had, uh, or if this game has fall damage, but I don't really want to, because <laughs> I don't wanna reset this. Pretty sure we hit a checkpoint by lowering the bridge. We missed out on two scrolls. Whatever. We're, we're just gonna. We're just gonna go. <laughs> what do we get for that mission? Like a D? Oh, we got a B. That's not too bad. Not too bad at all. Fable triggering you. Fable? Like the Xbox game? Well, actually, I think they made it for PC. Shows you all the scrolls. That's that thing is so cool. There's another guy right there. Oh my gosh. Almost got wrecked. Is he 
you actually trying to hit? Oh, there's two right there. Oh, I'm so dead. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna just chill right here, though. It's a good, good, good spot. What? Did they, they just put the alarm twice? Oh. Okay, so that was a, that was a bad path thing over there.